Back to the action here in Caloocan Sports Complex. And hug time again. Here we go. Let's see if we can uh, get one hug in. At least one in the coverage. There's a shot though. Let's go. It's Christmas time. All about giving love here in the Philippines. Hey, at, at the end of the night, if nobody <laughs> does it, we gotta ask PJ Ramos to hug somebody. <laughs> yeah. About Bear two hug. feet smaller than him. <laughs> but check this out, Christian. Uh, Balkman and Ramos already combining with 20 for 23 rebounds. The entire Singapore squad with 25 oh. in total. Oh wow. That's, That's an outstanding stat. At that time, Singapore able to score on that mid-range J. Both, both also, I believe, is in having a double-double. That's right. Already with double-double. Parks for three. Knocks it down. And not to be forgotten, your third option has 16 points, I believe. Yeah. 16 points. <laughs> That's a third That's scoring it. option for Adam. <laughs> but again, John Fields converting on the other end, banking that one in. Quick answer for the Singapore Slingers. But they cannot trade baskets with Alab here in the third. Alab, on the other hand, on fire to begin our second half. Alvano. 1-3-1 one, one zone by the Red Shirts. They go to Parks again. Parks kicks it out to Chong Son. Ramos surveying the floor. Goes to Bachman underneath. Five seconds. Bachman shoots. That's too strong. Young, oh, tipping it to the wrong man. Parks retrieving it. I failed to communicate that time for Young and Alexander yeah. to get that rebound. Chong Sun falls down. Battle for the rebound. It goes to Ang Han Bin. Two on one break. Fields will lay it up and in. 14 point lead for Ala Filipinas. And that's what Singapore has to do, even if they have to be scrappy just to score on the other end. Kalen Chong Sun gets it to Alvano. Oh, that is stolen away by Jaron Young. Young is on the move. He will be fouled by Kalen Chong Son, and this is going to be an unsportsmanlike foul on Kalen. I Did not make this uh, call right here. Yeah, let's see the replay though, Christian. Right there, I thought, even though it was a Judy foul, uh -huh. Jaron Young lost his balance first as he tried for that inside-out move. I think the, the result of the call was more of the impact of the fall. Right. Uh -huh. Rather than the initial contact. Right, right. Okay. So Young. But still a big break for yeah. the Singers, forcing two turnovers. And then two free throws coming up for Young to try to get his confidence. And they will have ball possession. That's right. Way to put out the fire here for the Singapore Slingers. Young with five points and six rebounds so far. Not bouncing back well after that 10 point outing against uh, Hong Kong Eastern. He drops in the first free throw. Kaelan Chong Son. Call for the unsportsmanlike foul here. Six points, six boards. Very talented scorer, Jaron Young. Two for two. Slingers will have possession and a chance to trim the lead further. Delvin will trigger it in to the X Man. John Fields on top, swinging it to Angheim Bin. They go to Xavier on the curl. Good switch by Bachman to take away the post entry on Young. Mid-range J, difficult shot put up by Alexander. Great defense by Alan. Kalen on the move. Attacking and taking it out. Last touch on Singapore. And a lot of time to work with for San Miguel Alan Filipinas. Good job by Han Bing now to move his feet and to stop the potential transition too by Alan. 6 and 20 remaining here in the third quarter. It is a 12 point advantage for Alab. Alvano left open. Could not make it. Here comes Alexander on the other side. Delvin goes back out to Young. He uses the screen given up by Delvin Go. Young from mid range that rattles in. There it is. So nine points now in the basketball game for Jaron Young. And that bucket cuts the lead down to 10 points, 54-44. And back to the action, back to our coverage. There was CN Basketball League, last game day of 2018 between San Miguel Ala Filipinas and the Singapore Slingers. 
eight to nothing run for Singapore, cutting the lead down to 10 points. John Fields getting into the mix. Jaron Young back to Fields, couple of buckets from the big man. And of course, this was the mid-range J before the timeout for Young. Nine points here in uh, the basketball game. Four coming here in the third already. And the fans again cheering for the home side, San Miguel Ala Pilipinas. Looking to put out the fire here. No, Martin, you made a great point earlier of them. Singapore cannot afford to trade baskets, which they were able to do so, forcing two straight turnovers mm -hmm. and eventually getting that big break on the unsportsmanlike. But PJ Ramos. <laughs> As you mentioned, the defense of the Slingers, Ramos scoring on that defensive sequence, knocking down the bucket. Big shot to stop the bleeding. Fields, Ang Han Bin, they go to Xavier Alexander. Looking for Young here, gets it to him. Nice draw pass inside. Devin Go could not finish though. Alvano on the move. Ethan with the ball, cross court to Parks. Back to Alvano. And they will slow it down on this sequence. Alvano to Chong Son. On top to Ramos, back to Chong Son. Who fires? No good. Young with the board. Quickly the other way to Delvin Go. Delvin spinning on Chong Son. Mid range shot for Fields is good. 20 points now in the game for John Fields. Well, he's been a bright spot for them. Led all scorers in the first half with 12 points on 6 for 15 shooting. And the slinger still not going away here in the third. Ramos gets it to Balkman. There you go. Balk makes his way to the hoop. <laughs> That's the way to break a zone, not to just pass the ball around, around the arc, but hit it inside and put pressure on the defense. Back to a 12-point lead for Ala Pilipinas, but Alexander able to get the personal foul against the home team. Let's now go to Sydney Crespo for a report. Go ahead, Sydney. I told you they're not going to make it easy for us. This is what um, Coach Jimmy sent out to his uh, men in the huddle to, as a reminder, that Singapore is not going to let go of this game without a fight. And both teams emphasize defense in the huddle as Coach Neo of Singapore rallied to the Slingers that they need to push it hard with their defense and give it what it takes to successfully close out this game tonight. Gentlemen, your thoughts on the defense of the teams tonight? Thank you, Sydney. Well, it's been a fast-paced uh, game so far, but Ala Pilipinas getting the better of right. the Singapore Slingers, responding very well to the instructions of Coach Jimmy. I think you got to credit, you know, Bobby Ray Parks. He, he's been terrific on yeah. both ends. You know, led all scorers in the first half. 13 has 16 in the ball game, and has been terrific individually to yeah. defend and make Young struggle and work hard for his shots. Young, though. On cue, back-to-back -back baskets with that mid-range J. And that cuts the lead down to uh, 10 points. 11 points now for Jaron Young. He reaches double figures here in the third quarter. So Parks, he gets it to Ramos, who's guarded by Fields. Balkman goes baseline off the glass, no good. Alexander on the move. On the other side here, Delvin Go catches it. Does not challenge Ramos, goes for the mid-range, no good. Ramos, outlet pass. Balkman, that is broken up by Jaron Young. What an effort by Jaron Young not to give up on the play. <laughs> How about that pass once again by yeah. Ramos? Making it look easy here. It's look like at a that baseball. <laughs> right. But again, good deflection for Jaron Young to prevent the easy basket. Balk attacks again though. Back-to-back -back misses. Good no the Balkman. Ang Bin, catch and shoot. No good, Orbis Tondo getting the rebound. The fireball. Goes to Balkman. Ronaldo behind the back. No good, Ang Bin with a board. And that's three straight misses now for Ronaldo Balkman. Jaron Young flips it up and gets the personal on Bobby Ray. Second foul 
on Bobby Ray Parks. And this will mean free throws for Jaron Young as he was taken in the act of shooting. Well, it's been a while since Singapore has broken this, you know, what seemed to be a stretch of a 10-point lead right. in the last maybe three or four minutes. And I was about to say they had to score on this one. And Jared Young with a pair with that opportunity coming up. Ala Pilipinas was actually able to stretch the lead up to 17 points here in the third quarter. It was 51-34 at one point. But Singapore again with a response. But Jaron Young could not make it a uh, well a single digit lead his first miss at the line young still with 11 points six here in the third quarter had a little bit of everything 10 points eight rebounds seven assists against hong kong last friday and he splits his charities nine point lead for alab three minutes remaining here in the third quarter San Miguel Ala Pilipinas with possession. The fireball looking for Ramos. PJ with the left hand. No good. PJ on the second serving. Still off. Oh, he tips it back in. Too tall. Is PJ Ramos underneath? Fields. No good. That'll be against Singapore. And that's going to be a foul here against Calvin Lim. First foul on Lim. PJ Ramos, by the way. 18 points, 13 rebounds already. Ray Parks, they go to Urbistondo. Two and a half remaining. Lo Domingo falls right. down hard. And that was the result of the play the previous play where in Domingo screen fields yeah. excellently that opened up uh, the shot inside by Ramos which he had two more opportunities and that's why fields is not gonna have any of it again that's right that time with the foul and that's when you that's when you value a guy like Domingo he does the little things yeah. he runs the floor well gets rebounds and it's usually quicker to the ball just like right there although ball ends up with a red shirt Got a hand on a basketball there while getting the rebound. Jaron Young now on a crossover, pulling up, drops in the jumper. Might have been fouled too. Play so continues on. 16 points for Jaron Young. Oh no, 14 points rather for Young. That cuts the lead down to nine. Orbistondo surveying the floor. 10 seconds to shoot for Ala Pilipinas. They get it to Balkman. Down low to Ramos and PJ will be fouled on his way to the hoop. That's better be job, hard. sorry about that Martin. Uh, better job done that time by Alan Filipinas, not only getting and attacking this 1-3-1 one, one zone yeah. in the corners, but swinging the basketball side to side and finally hitting that high post in Buckman as he hits a guy inside for the mini high-low Ramos with a pair. PJ Ramos on your screens now, 18 points. 13 rebounds, monster double-double for the Puerto Rican. And he drops in the free throw. He's also got the sweet touch on his jumpers. What a one-two punch for Puerto Rico. Huh? JJ <laughs> Barrea, right? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> PJ Ramos. PJ Ramos. At your Man. one and five position. <laughs> <laughs> Talk about defending a pick and roll. How do you mm -hmm. stop that? You don't. <laughs> Except when you're United States, though. Right. Yeah. <laughs> right. <laughs> so it's 62 51. Two points by Ala Pilipinas, converted by Ramos. Under two remaining. In the third quarter, Singapore Slingers trying to fight back here. Well, good hands by Rosser getting a hand in to deflect that one. So 12 seconds to work with for the Singapore Slingers. Alexander getting it to Delvin Go. Shot clock is down to seven. Jaron Young shoots over Balkman. Young banks it in. Three pointer is good for Young. Starting the third with back to back Jays inside the arc. That time outside uses the glass. 
Even when it's 9 p.m. That's right. Bank so is open. Bank is open. And a three-pointer cuts the lead down to eight. 12 points this quarter for Jaron Young. Balkman inside. One dribble in. No good. Alexander gets the rebound. The X-Man gets it to Young. Stop, shoots. Oh! Miscommunication there between Young and Fields. As Young went for the extra pass inside. Also a missed opportunity because Bachman trotted back. Mm -hmm. which they had numbers five versus four. They could have trimmed this lead down to maybe five yeah. or six. 45, 43 seconds remaining. Rosser for three. Launches too strong. Kevin Lim retrieving the ball. Xavier again on the move. Dropping it in. Fields working hard down low, and that will be a foul on Rosser. No reason to, to help that time was Rosser, as I thought Domingo did a good job of cutting off the baseline, but he overhelps and opens up the drop on Fields. Here's the move again, Xavier Alexander getting to, or getting it to John Fields down low, getting the personal on Rosser, and the Slingers have actually done a great job in hanging around in this third quarter, Christian. Right. Only down by eight on what feels like an all alab quarter here in the third. They gotta make their free throws though. Fields connecting on the second. Lead is down to seven, 55-62. Pau Havilona, or Havilona checking in for Bobby Ray Parks Jr. Havilona. Or Papa Havilona bringing the ball down here. He's got Kevin Lim on him. Havilona to Balkman. Puts it on the floor. Could not finish with the left hand. The tip does not work as well for Domingo. Sharon Young on the move. Oh, Havilona with a steal. Obistando ahead of the pack. Retreats. Attacks again. Flips it up. Could not drop it in. And that will mark the end of the third quarter. Here in our coverage of the ABL9, it is a seven point lead for San Miguel Ala Filipinas as we continue to see the highlights here of the third Christian. Uh, can you give what happened here in the third quarter? Alap got to a great start, but Singapore responding back and trimming the lead down to seven. Well, this guy on your screen's got it going, had 12 points in the third quarter. We mentioned the struggles in the first half. Did a good job, yeah. as you mentioned, of hanging around they have to do a better job though in the fourth quarter to make more baskets and get stops. And we have a seven point game going into the final frame. Christian Basketball League will be right back.